Hello, my friends. Good morning. Uh, a couple minutes late. Sorry about that. Uh, you know, you guys have no idea how much is involved behind the scenes that you can't see. It's in, it's just crazy. So let me just jump in and start doing our um, good mornings. Um, hi, Florence in Missouri. Hi, Jan in Kansas. Good morning. Hi, Jeffrey. I always love your posts, Jeffrey. They're always so sweet. Hi, Mary. Hi, Lori. Hi, Carrie. Good morning. Um, let's see. Hi, Karen. Yes, this is episode 100. Karen just pointed out. Yes, it is. Kenny told me to make a big deal about that. So, whoa, 100. Oh my gosh, that's almost two full years, huh, Kenny? Yep. We started it in January of last year. I mean, two years ago already. Before COVID. We were like pre-COVID. We were doing lives pre-COVID. Go us. Have some party balloons and hats. I know, right? At least on our second anniversary. I mean, yeah, so like technically that would be on 104, right? Would be exactly two years, right? Because that's 52 I plus 52. About 104. Well, I know, but that's two year anniversary. I care about 100. I know, but. Nobody <laughs> celebrates 104. <laughs> but that's two year. That'll be our no, two year anniversary. That's lame. Oh, stop. <laughs> hi, Jeannie. Hi, Gloria. Good morning, my friend. Hi, Janine. Hi, Carrie. Hi, Terry. Um, hi Arlene, hi Karen in Arizona. Hi Russ, good morning. Uh, oh Russ, you're being silly. He says, congratulations on 100 episodes. What is the name of this again? Yeah, exactly. It's called You Can't Make This Up, right? Uh, Stephanie's Crafting <laughs> Corner. Am I right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I only took 100 episodes. 100 <laughs> episodes it took. That's all. Russ, you're so funny. Um, hi, Deborah. Merry Christmas to you, too, my love. Um, oh, you're so sweet. Thank you. 100 episodes. I can't believe it. I know. I'm really excited. Um, I don't know if you can notice, but um, my I'm like all a mess, um, congested-wise. Uh, Miller, my baby boy, my youngest baby boy, uh, twin, I mean, grandson, um, was sick on, started getting sick on Saturday, right? And uh, we babysat him and he went to the doctor, when can he, on Monday. And the doctor said, yep, there's nothing we can do. He's just got to wear it through. They did test him for COVID. He was negative. So uh, he still has fevers and he's still having fevers. And now, of course, Liam is sick. And so she's going back to the doctor again today because, uh, you know, hello, um, the new thing now is not to give them antibiotics. When my kids were little, and I don't know about you guys, but when my kids were little, when they had a dark green nose, it was time for antibiotics. It was just an easy thing. When I saw a green nose, oh, Glory wants me to remind you to give thumbs up and likes and shares and yes, and a subscribe. Thank you, Beverly, 100. Yes, I know, I can't believe it. And, but now that's not the thing to do with your antibiotics, apparently. Um, my kids turned out just fine. They are not resistant to antibiotics, um, but they don't do it anymore. And so the doctor just sends them home and says, you know, keep an eye on them. Um, did they check for RSV? Yes, they checked for a lot of things with Miller. So they um, did the COVID, they did the flu, and they did pneumonia, I'm sorry, that's the same one. They did COVID, the flu, and RSV. And he was negative on all of them. What does that stand for? Respiratory RSV. something, I don't know. And he's negative. And so, well, guess what? Miller shared his cold with Liam. So now they're both sick. Now Kirsten is sick. Now Colin is sick. And guess who is sick also? Nana. I don't feel that bad. My throat hurts and my I've taken cold medicine, but my nose is like all just like I can I can just hear my voice sounds different. So Kenny, can you tell my voice sounds different? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Uh, I don't know if it's just in my head that it sounds different or if it really does sound different. Merry Christmas to you, Anne, in Canada. Um, yeah, so their whole family's sick. I'm sick. Kenny it will never claim he's sick, so he's fine. Um, Kate's okay so far. My parents haven't seen us in over a week, so they are good. And now we're supposed to have everybody over for, on Christmas. So I don't Christmas know. is canceled. No, Christmas is oh. canceled. <laughs> um, but I don't know what we're going to do. 
So, good times at this house. I know. No fun having sick babies. I know. Oh, Jeffrey got his December kit already. Yay! Um, what is that, Kenny? Christmas Sorry, music. music. Yeah. It's not supposed to happen, not but... Mm -mm. Um, oh, Debbie just got back from her daughter's wedding in Hawaii. Oh, congratulations. Russ says, doctors started cutting back on antibiotics for non-viral er illnesses because more resistant bugs were occurring. My first research areas of the drug company at the anti in okay but russ the baby's still sick the baby needs medicine <laughs> and the doctor said only tylenol not even like cold medicine remember dimetab the great bottle oh my gosh my parents used to put it in my bot in my baby bottle practically no no cold medicine so i'm hoping we get something i thought they give you alcohol when you're a baby <laughs> Oh, they did. <laughs> Hi, Kathy. They did give. They put vodka on my um, lip, on my gums when I was teething. The things they did back in the day. My mom still thinks you should do it here nowadays. <laughs> mom, what? Okay. Oh, Ruth said they canceled hers. I saw another one say that they canceled theirs. Um, oh, Sarah said she um, tested positive for COVID at a home test. Oh. Yeah, it, it, I know. I think it's going around. Um, yeah, Laura, we don't think they have a virus, though. So I think, yeah, because antibiotics, you're right. Antibiotics don't work for viruses. I know. Um, uh, yeah, it's, yeah, a lot of people are canceling. Hi, Nancy. Happy Merry Christmas and Happy New Year to you. Oh, Kathy. She says, please send good thoughts. My husband is going into memory care today. Rough day. Oh, Kathy. We'll pray for you. Write down that, Kenny. Yes. Kathy Hawkins. Okay. Um, Merry Christmas, Reagan. Hello. Um, vodka or whiskey? Yeah, seriously, they did vodka. They did. They really did on my gums. Can you believe it? Um, yeah. Oh, okay. I'm trying to read these. Um, oh, it is not. Oh, it just started raining, Kenny. There's sprinkles out there now. They were right. They said 100%. They did. They said 100% <laughs> chance it was going to rain today. At 11, right? They were right. <laughs> Yeah, they did. They did. Okay, so there was one thing Kenny and I ta thought about that we wanted to talk about today because you know how we always forget. And yes, we went to dinner at Olive Garden yesterday because uh, I, I taped our videos for January yesterday. So he was very, hi, Nancy. Oh, hey, Nancy. And Mr. Empty Pockets, Tim. Um, Nancy, your bags are slowly disappearing from my house because my children have claimed them, <laughs> which is good. Which is good. Katie needed a bag the other day, and she's uh, she's like, this one's perfect. And I'm like, mm, okay, I want a bag. And then the babies love the little zipper one that has the little clip. We clip them to our chairs and um, our dining table chair. Not our breakfast. We don't have a dining room. Our our chairs. And um, they have a zipper on them, so they play with the zipper, and they put their toys in them, and they zip it up. And then it's gone. And then they unzip it, and there it is. So we've been playing with those a lot, so thank you. Um what was the, remember, Kenny, I said we were going to talk about something, and I said I'm going to text us because we're not going to remember if we don't text. Um, oh, so we were talking about getting sick. And I go, Kenny, you're never sick. And he goes, well, remember that one time in Texas? Yes. So let me tell you a quick story. Kenny is never sick, by the way. Um, and when he is, he just sleeps. He doesn't say one bad thing. Like, I, like I'll i say, my nose is running. Or, my throat hurts. I mean, I complain. All I just talk about it all day, right? Well, Ken doesn't. He doesn't. He just doesn't say anything. Well, like, he could probably be on his deathbed, and he won't tell me. Um, but would you please, if you're, if you're really feeling that bad, Kenny, will you please tell me so I know? I'm going to die? Yeah, because then I can like get a picture of the health insurance. I mean, the sure. health insurance is in order. Yeah. I'm just teasing. Well, when I'm, I'm about ready to check out, I'll let you know. Okay. Okay. So, um, but we were in Texas. How many years ago do you think this was, Kenny? Like five or six years, five I would say. Five or six years ago. Yeah. And we're at in Texas. And Kenny's standing at the cash register. And, like, I'm telling you, he looked green. He was, like, going, he was just, like, moving like this. And he was just, like, kind of like this. And I'm all, are you okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. And like, you didn't want to talk, huh? Because you were afraid you were going to throw up. Yep. <laughs> and so he just like, he would just stand there at the cash register. I'm all, you need to leave. I'm all, you're going to get people sick. You need to leave. 
And so you but I had, said no. And then you went and sat down somewhere, right? You went and sat like in the Yeah. Or I just said, What has happened to my life? I'm here in Texas and I'm sick. <laughs> and so you went and, like sat down on in the bench, lobby, yeah. And you fell asleep, didn't you? No, I didn't fall asleep. I think you fell asleep. No. We might have a witness. <laughs> okay. If anybody has a picture or I think I know who might be. <laughs> I don't believe it. Danya on our now design team. Back then, we barely knew her. I think it was the first time we met her, don't you think? No, we knew her. I don't I wouldn't get in a car with the stranger. Yes, you would. <laughs> and I did. And um, she said, let me take you to urgent care. And when Ken wants to go to the... When, if Ken is willing to go to the doctor, that means he is very sick. And he let Danya, a stranger in Texas, take him to the doctor. Bless her heart. She took him to the doctor and brought him back. Okay, that it goes above and beyond. And that's not even why she's on the design team. <laughs> but, yes. Um, Nancy, what are the boys' favorite color and animal? Um, they love... Who are they loving right now? They love Cookie Mouse. That mouse give a cookie. Cuckoo? Uh, oh, no. They, they love any animals. Dinosaurs, they love... Yeah. Um, uh, they love any, any, any character. Anything. Anything. Uh, they love Elmo all of a sudden. Miller does especially... Um, Barney, a little. Barney. We haven't done much with Barney lately. Yeah, we haven't done much with Barney. Um, uh, Momo. Oh, there's a dog named Momo. We'll find Momo. <laughs> don't, don't. What's uh, the blue but one? But if you are get Louie? I, I didn't mean for you to make them something, Nancy, yeah, yeah. but but if you were going to, make them the exact same because <laughs> we have less problems than like sharing. But you don't have to make them anything. They love the two that you gave us. Um, okay, so yeah, Ken got in a, in a car with a stranger to take him to the doctor. That was entertaining. Did you get medicine? Yeah, they gave me something. Cause... So obviously he had something. Hi, Barbara. Hello. Hi, Bonnie in Florida. Um, Deborah says she's praying for Kathy. Thank you. That's nice. Um, Carol. Hi, Carol. My Florida friend. Um, so one of my questions is, is um, what, what are we doing Christmas? What are you doing? That camera's out of focus. Oh. There it goes. Oh, there it goes. Um, so, Christmas Day. What? This is our schedule if everyone's well. Yeah. This is our schedule yeah. if everyone's well. Tomorrow, my mom and dad are going to come and spend the night. Because they usually always do that. They always do that. Although last year, I don't think they did. Okay. When we lived at Mark's house, did they, um, did they stay with us? No, I don't think they did. I'm sure they did. I don't think they did. Okay, so then... We're going to go um, to dinner, and, we're, and Katie will be with us, and then we're going to church for a church service, and then we're going to come home, and my mom will make us play games, because that's just what she likes to do. What does she like to play? That triple E? No, Rummy Cube. Rummy Cubes. Then we are going to go to sleep, and Santa will come, and the babies will be at their house for Santa to deliver his gifts at their house, because, you know, Santa might not know where they are. And so they will be at their house, and then as soon as they get to do all their Santa gifts, they are all going to come over here, and then we will have our Christmas breakfast and open some gifts, and then the babies will go home and take their nap, and Papa will take his nap, and Kenny will start cooking, and then we're going to try to get Kenny a nap, though, too. And then we will come back, and we will do get more gifts with my brother and his family, because they will come over, and then we will eat dinner. So, that is it. That is it. Um, and it might says, rain. And it might rain. Deborah says she's working on Christmas for next year. Cards? Deborah, you need to come to my house and help me. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because I'm not done wrapping. Kenny and I started last night. But I ran out of Christmas tags. So, I'll be honest. When I make Christmas tags, I save them. And I reused them. And I'm out of them. So, <laughs> I need to make some more. I had to make some homemade ones yesterday. I know, fake ones. Like <laughs> on wrapping paper, you just cut pieces of paper and said, to Stephanie, love Kent. So I'm going to make um, the A1 envelope. I asked them to rush it, Terry. So um, I don't know when she said it would get here, but it, it, I put a rush on it. I did put a rush on it. Can you text a picture of the boy's stroller? My cell number is on the letter I sent. Um, Nancy, write, I mean, can you write that down? She what? wants to see a, a picture of their stroller. For who? For Nancy? Nancy. Yeah, Nancy. 
Um, so here we go. I'm going to be making some tags because I am behind. Um, I grabbed my scrap bucket because yes, I do use my scraps all the time. And I grabbed out a whole bunch of my, um, a whole bunch of my tags. And so this is crunch time, right? So this, these, pro the tags I'm making today are not for the Hall of Fame type things, right? They are so the people know who it's for, right? We're not talking Hall of Fame here, but we want them to still look kind of cute, right? So I'm gonna get some tags. I grabbed some tags. You wanna do the overhead, Kenny, so they can just see what I have here. Mm -hmm. So I grabbed these tags. Um, these are the dotted tags. These are, I don't know what these are called. Hang on. I think I had like a real one. Kenny, do you know what these are called? He's busy texting on his phone. Oh, hang on. I have, nope, that's not it. Uh, I don't know what it's called. Tags. It's just called tags. Okay. And then I also grabbed the HSN tags. Now the HSN tag, oh, they can't see it. The HSN tags have lots of extra goodies in them. They have little tag toppers. They have ho, 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 Mary, Noel for you. Um, lots of pieces. Um, they also have some cute little Christmas trees. I want to grab one of those. But these are like when you have time. Stephanie doesn't have time. Oh, but she can maybe do a candy cane. So we're not going to use those. We're just going to use the we are desperate type tags, okay? So I'm going to grab like the, one of the smaller ones, not the largest one, because you know what? I'm in a hurry. Now, also, I'm not going to use the dotted right now because what? Yeah, I'm in a hurry. So this is literally crunch time kind of thing. Um, and we are just going to get some done. That's the whole idea here. So what I'm going to do is... Which is normal for us, right? Yes. <laughs> Yes, because Ken Crunch reminded time. me this time last year, we not only had Christmas, but four days later we moved. So, yeah, we're kind of used to that kind of stuff. So we're not actually going to try to use this one today, honey, so you might not oh. need to hook that up. Okay. But, um, so I'm going to use my um, mini Gemini because it's awesome. Now, I know some of you have asked about more refills for the, um, the cutting folders for this machine coming um, early January, early, early January, uh, because I just actually got an email from them today and she said, yep, we'll add it to your order. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to die cut and I don't know if I can fit more than one on here. I might not be able to, but maybe I can fit a littler one. Let's do a littler one. So I'm going to add two tags on here and I'm just going to run it through. Now, when you have smaller items and it should stick to my table, but I think because I have paper on it, it won't. But when you have um, littler items, this machine is like, so, to me, honestly, so much faster. Um, and, you know, the name of the game right now is get it done. So we're going to get it done. And I'm going to throw that one on there really quick. Kenny, can, can you look at like any questions or any comments? Because I'm trying to get some. Yeah, I'll start time. looking. So he's going to start looking. Um, see now I know some of you just a heads up are getting gift cards for Christmas I've seen a couple of those go through so just a heads up if you've told your friends and family that's what you want some of you are getting them um, if you haven't tell them hey last minute gift idea ding 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 you can get me you know gift cards to stamps of life so Billy wants to know if you're gonna do any more tray kits tray kits not um we will not be doing any more exclusive ones we are going to start carrying the foundations decor ones that they have um however they are out of january as of this moment um you know everything is literally on the boats and they're waiting as patiently or impatiently as we are because i'm waiting too so in the meantime um You'll see mine in January. I'm going to be doing like more of the home family. I'm going to leave the family up and I'm going to do um, more of the letter trays and um, I will be decorating that. So it'll be saying like home and family and things like that. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm just as sad as you guys are on that. Okay, so I've die cut a whole bunch of tags. I don't know. I might need a couple bigger ones. So I'm going to grab the larger one. Um, let's see. So I have the larger one here. And I'm going to grab some more cardstock, lay that down. So you can see I've die cut like quite a few little um, tags while we've been just chit chatting here. Will there be a die for the, I think it's the A1 card for the envelope? 
Uh, we won't count. Maybe. De okay, well, there be. That's what Debbie said. So. Uh, there is a maybe it's sold envelope. out. Okay, it's is sold that out. What the question was, I don't know. What Will there be a die for? It says E V E A one card. I don't know what that means. Help me out. Tell me. Tell me what. Oh, it now is. she says, is there a card die for the A one size? I'm sorry. Yes, that <laughs> is in our kit club. Um, we will be offering it on our website in approximately four months. So um, if you're not in the kit club, it, you should get it in about, uh, it'll be on our website in about four months. Um, and here's a trick on my, so I keep in my um, craft workstation, I do keep my extra um, cutting pads here because this one pretty much stays on my desk now. Whatever I'm working on, this stays here. Um, it goes in here. So um, my cutting pads are here, but look at where I found to put my little cutting pads. Isn't that cute? Just right there on the side. So I always have extras just because, you know, I mean, they do wear out eventually, but uh, you, you know, you have quite a bit. So now I've die cut some of those. And now what I, I've also done is I've pulled out my um, adhesive backed paper. So all of my reds are in here. All of my greens are in here with the adhesive on the back. So my special scraps, these are my special scraps because they have the adhesive on the back. So I'm going to grab some of these for some die cut letters. So I'm just gonna grab some green. Now remember, oh, and some trees, right? I'm gonna do some trees and candy canes. So I'm just gonna grab some red. Oh, that one's kind of ugly. Um, well, it'll work. So red and, ooh, glitter. Can't go wrong with glitter. Okay, so now what I'm gonna, that one does not have it. Here's an idea, Will, um, I think I have her name right. Will Helmina uses old pictures and she cuts them out in like the shapes of um, the tags, but like, Old pictures of people, like that in the family or something. And then idea. I guess they have to guess who it is to figure out who the gift goes to. <laughs> that is awesome! I love that idea. That is awesome. So they get to see their picture. Yeah, like when they were babies. She says some of the time, even old baby oh, pictures. Oh, I love that. Now I one of my cute things is um, uh, I have. Uh, oh, you might want to show this. I have picture. I mean, I did uh, footprints of the babies onto gift bags. Um, M-I-L-L-E. Um, and, but that's cute. I love the idea of the, um, of the picture. How fun. Now I got to be a little careful with this. So I hold it closed, hold it closed so those letters don't move. And I'm going to run this through. It's a little hard. I could have, um, washi taped them, but I'm too lazy. And so I'm running that through. So now I have Miller's name. And of course, um, for the sake of video, I should have done Liam's name because that's faster. Um, so let's grab this one. And well, let's grab this one. And let's do Liam. So Liam, oddly enough, uses a lot of the same letters, um, L, I, and M. Um, so there's L. And here's I. I should make Ken help me. Now, Ken did help me do some wrapping the other day which I was very thankful because, you know, seriously, I'm running out of time. And uh, Liam, so L-I-A-M. So there's my, there's my, whoops, there's my La. Liam. Yeah, I know it's all backwards. But <laughs> then I'm going to add my little candy cane in there because I can, right? And I'm going to lay that down and I'm going to run it through. Easy peasy. It is raining outside. Okay, so now we have Liam. And then I've also stamped quite a few. I mean, I'm going to stamp some too. So let's bring this all in. Let's look at how fast we can make some cute tags. Because, you know, people know you're crafty, so they kind of have certain expectations. Did and you make this? Yeah, that's it's kind of a problem. Say. Like, what? You, what? you just wrote on the present? You didn't like I thought you'd make it. it. Yeah, we don't want to hear any of that, right? <laughs> so, um there's kind of certain expectations and I need to deal with that. So we're going to grab our Liam real Whoops. quick. Split camera, sorry Split about that. camera, oh. That's not good. Fancy, fancy, fancy. Okay, so we're gonna grab this. You guys, I've gotten so many and I'll show them on a No Makeup Monday coming soon. I got, I've gotten, so, we have gotten so many beautiful Christmas cards. Thank you, I love seeing your Christmas cards. So um, if you've sent me one, um, look for it soon in a um, uh, No Makeup Monday video coming soon. Look at that. Isn't that cute? Um, because um, it, it's so sweet to get your Christmas cards and to see them. So thank you. Thank you for sending them in. 
Um, so I'm going to peel this up. And I've gotten one or two little gifts, which you guys are too sweet. And I will show those as well on Monday because I have not opened them yet because it's for Christmas. I have to wait. Even though I don't want to wait, <laughs> I have to. Yeah, did you give out some gifts to the kids before they were supposed of to get them? Of course I did. That's what you're supposed to do is when you're in Nana. Ah. You give it to them as soon as you buy it. <laughs> yeah, you know, so back back in the day, I used to always buy myself Christmas gifts. Now I just buy for the babies. Here's a good laugher. What? Margaret wants to know, did you make your own Christmas cards this year? And how many did you how many do you make? I there don't make Stephanie. very many. <laughs> Margaret, I don't make very many. So probably what? Twelve to fifteen got real cards. I would say twelve to fifteen got real cards. <laughs> the rest kind of didn't. Because you know, I don't get as much time as I used to to play. See, you know, when I started this company, I kind of thought like, oh yeah, I'll get to stamp all day. I'll get to, you know, we'll just do all this, this and that and this. And unfortunately, that's not exactly how it works. Instead, I have to look at spreadsheets and I have to look at um, inventory numbers and I have to look at, uh, for well co companies ask me what's my forecast I'm all, i don't even know what that is i'm all rainy no but like you're supposed to know like oh i think we're gonna sell this many you think i know this kind of stuff i don't know this kind of stuff so kenny and i kind of fake it but um yeah and so i don't necessarily get to actually play so when i do these videos hello i get to play which is very exciting um they can't even see my face but I'm talking I just switched. Yeah, oh, yeah, I switched. Okay. Yeah, I just switched. I was like talking to them. Yep, I had you on there for a long time, and okay. I'm like, okay. okay. Stephanie, yes. So Mary wants to know if we can get a Yorkie or Daoshan uh, fold it. Is Yorkie kind of like cookie? Yeah, you know what? That make one's kind of like cookie. You could just color it brown. Yeah, if you just color but it. But a um, weenie dog. Um, I'm trying to think. I thought we had one in the work we might have one in the works on that. have you ever heard of panatone yes why because carol says she's eating that oh okay <laughs> well, she's I told, watching I today i don't know what pantone wrong pantone. <laughs> i've never heard of that Pan i don't know what that is so carol you're gonna have to tell us what that is because we don't know what is it how do you spell it p-a-n-e like bread it sounds like t-t-o-n-e i don't know what that is Send me some. I know. I think she wants us to guess. Maybe somebody out there can I've help us. I've had Tim Tams before. That's from Australia. <laughs> she doesn't say she's from Australia, so I don't Is know. Is it Carol from Florida that we know? Carol Burns, oh, I don't not know Carol, Carol Stoller. Oh, okay. So there's my Miller. Cute. Look, Liam. Now, come on. Is that like the cutest little tag you ever saw? Okay. So then we're like all, Stephanie, you're running out of time. Yeah. You need to hurry up. Especially you should so, probably pick the people who could read the tags first. I know. Oh. <laughs> Okay, that was a good point. <laughs> good that point, right? was a good point. Since you got to go for top priority. Yes. So here's mom's. Look at that. Boom. There Mom. it is. Oop, there it is. Or if you turn it upside down. Wow. Wow. <laughs> nice. See, do you think it's a? Do you think that it's an accident that mom upside down is wow? That was planned a mm. billion years ago. Let me tell you, because. Come on, Ma, every mom is a super, super woman. Mm -hmm. And she's a wow. Carrie says she votes for a German Shepherd. German Shepherd. <laughs> German shepherd. For a uh, fold it. Oh, Carol says it's Italian Christmas bread. Ooh, I knew I had good. bread the pan right. I was, see. Ooh, my phone just silenced I could be bilingual off. and I don't even know. You're bilingual. <laughs> You're not bilingual. Shut up. Okay, so look what I'm doing. So the candy cane went off the edge. Oh, they can't see. The candy cane went off the edge a little bit. See how, and it's sticky there. So I'm going to get a piece of scrap paper. Whoops, whoops. Got to use your scraps, you guys. Use your scraps. And I'm going to use a little tiny bit of powder to make that not sticky on the back. There we go. And I'll throw that on the ground. So now, I, mom, oops, mom has a cute tag. Okay, so um, where's dad? Here's dad, oops, there's mom, there's Liam, Miller, mom, and dad. And if I just had Ken, then that's pretty much it. Mm. I usually just get a K written on the bag. Yeah, you sometimes do. <laughs> hey, 
Remember, I said we're in emergency times here. Linda wants to know uh, if there's a plan for the felt storage bag to get released. Yes, yes, yes. Finally, it was, I approved it for the 40th time, and I finally think that it's getting very, very close. So close, in fact, that I think, um, oh, I'm going to show you this trick. I think um, it's going to be like January, February. Okay, I want to show them this trick. Okay, so here I have my cute little tag, right? And here's my little Christmas tree that I want to cut out to add to my dad's tag, right? But what am I going to do instead? Check this out, you guys. I'm going to add that little tag right there. Gently close it. Pinch it so it doesn't move. Pinch it so it doesn't move. Run it through. Run it through. Don't, don't let it move. Okay, now you can let go. Run it through. Now watch this. Double duty. Double duty. Ready? Ready? Wait for it. Wait for it. Ta-da! Look how cute that tag is. It's like fast genius, right? Because I mainly needed it for this. But look how cute that tag is. And now I have double duty. Two birds, one stone. Because now I can go like this. Look at that. We are talking fast, quick, easy, right? So there's another one. And if I was even a little smarter on myself here I probably would have done it that way so I could read it but now I also want to write oh you know what we'll give this one to KJ because KJ's name is easy so I'm grabbing what stamp set am I using this is the where'd my stamps go oh where'd my stamps go they're right here can you see them what stamps my letter stamps they were really right here this happened to me the other day where I literally could not, like, I think it's because I'm thing. sick. You're losing it. I'm, oh, I lost that a long time ago. <laughs> oh, letters tray. Look, here's the, here's the envelope. Where are the stamps? <laughs> they were right there. I know. What happened? Oh, my gosh. I'm losing it. Did I put them in a drawer? What in the heck? Are you sure they're not on the floor or something? That's where the stuff usually goes. <laughs> And we're like live. live. I was like totally ignoring this is live. Sorry, guys. This is the live Christmas edition, so it's special. Special. Oh, we yes. got to do a raffle. So we are going to do a raffle, and we are going to say the question today is where are Stephanie's stamps? No, the question for the day is what are you most thankful for this year? What are you most thankful for this year? Everyone needs to answer. Everyone's thankful for something because it's been a crazy year, as we all know, almost as crazy as last year. I don't know what, what, what is worse, um, last year or this year? I don't know. This year's coming on strong right now. <laughs> I know, this is getting crazier now, huh? Mm -hmm. um, so what, what are you the most thankful for? Because even during this crazy times, we can still find things to be thankful for, which is nice, right? Because let me tell you, it doesn't get nuttier than this. Oh, I found them. They were where my blocks were. <laughs> I literally just remembered where they were. Um, so what are you most thankful for? I am most thankful for my miracle babies. Um, because this is going to make me cry. But two years ago, next week was when Kirsten started having contractions like in her like 22nd week or something. And it, it was very scary. And she ended up in the hospital multiple times with those babies wanting to come out. And she held them in for another couple of five weeks, I think. And they were born seven weeks early in the NICU for four to five weeks, four weeks for one, five weeks for the other, but then they came home and they are healthy little horses now. The modern technology now, I mean, modern medicine is pretty amazing. Um, do you want to do the overhead? It's pretty amazing because they are A-OK -okay now. And man, they are fun. Liam does not stop talking, let me tell you that. Woo, that kid's a genius. Okay, so there's my little <laughs> cage tag. What? Why are you laughing? Nothing. Why are you laughing? I was going to say that he follows in the steps of his grandma. I'm not his grandma. His nana. <laughs> nana. Okay, I'm not his grandma, so... <laughs> his nana. His granny. Yes. I'm not his granny. 
Spanish. <laughs> no, mom. My mom is grandma. I am Nana. Kenny is grandpa. And my dad is papa. So grandma and papa are married. And Nana and grandpa are married. But he's really not grandpa. Kenny's not really grandpa. He's Gaga. They call him Gaga. And when they get married and I'm at their wedding talking about their, I'm, and I'm doing the toast, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to call him Gaga. Just saying. You know. Do you think they'll have a double wedding? Like both get married on the same day? No. Don't twins do that kind of weird stuff? No. They're not <laughs> like, what are you talking about? No, they're individuals. <laughs> they couldn't be more different. No. That's true. No. Oh, and Liam, I mean, Miller is now into, um, we have some peg people, wooden peg people, and he loves them. And Miller, uh, Miller is also into the little people. And he loves the little people. And year, a couple of years ago, I bought Kirsten the little people, I think when she was pregnant, of The Office, because Kirsten loves The Office, the show The Office. Best show ever. And um, just, the, just the theme song reminds me of when she was a teenager and she'd sit downstairs and I'd be in my office upstairs. And I would the th she would be laughing at that, show, at that, um, at that show. And so, I, um, but Miller plays with those little guys too. He loves those guys. Thing is, with the little people, they just don't make them like they used to make them. True that. <laughs> True that. They are not nearly as good as the ones we had. And you remember used. when you went to search for them on the internet? You could find a lot of different little people. Yeah. 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 Just about anything you could think of, right? You could. <laughs> oh, yeah. This time, yes. Like, you can get Elvis in three different versions of little people. You can get Frozen. You can get the Disney princesses. You could get, I think, the Kiss people, you know, Kate, the, yes, the rock star yes, people. That's awesome. Like, what? <laughs> but, and you can get the office people, which is even weirder. I don't, I don't get it. But they've kind of sold out a little bit. Just saying. Okay. Um, are you going to pick a winner there, babe? I or picked a winner, yeah. Okay. So I want to look at some of the answers. Oh, Jamie says, survive COVID-19 and quarantine. Yes. Um, Lolly says, thankful that we've stayed cleared of COVID so far. Awesome. Um, let's see. Uh, Linda said, family, uh, God, family, love it, love it. Health and family, making cards, yay, our health, family. Life saving medical treatments, Lisa said. Yes, absolutely, absolutely. Um, let's see. God, family, friends. Hang on, I'm going to sneeze. Hang on, I'm going to sneeze. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. I couldn't turn off my mic in time. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. Um, Kenny, okay, go ahead and pick a winner. I have a winner from YouTube. She said family. Oh. And it is Becky Curtis. Becky, hang on, sorry. Sorry, I got a text in there for like, okay. Um, well, who was it? Becky, Ken's shaking his head at me. Becky what? Curtis. Curtis, Becky Curtis, what did she say? Family. Family, you just want a $25 gift certificate to our website. You're gonna email Faylene at info at the stamps of life .com. She will get that out to you. Is she working today? Well, I don't know. <laughs> Everybody's just making their own schedule pretty much this month. Yeah, so it's funny, like, I mean, because I don't want you to ever think in a million years that Ken and Stephanie do this on their own. We have mainly three awesome, incredible employees that really do the bulk of, you know, the stuff we can't do. And um, so we try to be as lenient as possible on, like, what time you come to work. Like, I mean, they pretty much are able to make their own schedule. They all know, the three of them know what needs to get done. And we can trust them enough to make their own schedules. Um, so you know, failing might only work one or two hours today, but she knows what has to get done. So um, we kind of, especially this month, because, you know, we want them to spend as much time as possible with their families. Uh, so, um, but Faylene will get that to you in the next few days. Give her a few days just in case, because I don't know what her schedule's looking like. And of course, I don't, nobody's working tomorrow, right? We're not supposed to be working tomorrow, right? So they have, they have tomorrow off. So, and of course, Christmas. Uh, so, but thank you. Yes, Becky, way to go. Um, Beatrice says we need more project ideas for felt. Beatrice, did you see me like my, um, did you see my bird felt project that I just did um, for the babies? 
I did it on a um, crafting corner, what, two weeks ago, Kenny, was it? I just bought the flannel for their board, so I'm going to make them a flannel board. And I did the felt, but also you could use the felt, and I did this on another one where, um, just recently, where I did it the Santa fold it, but I used felt instead of paper, cardstock. So go tr make sure you've seen both of those. you got to make a Jesus flannel board. When I was a kid and went to church, they always had <laughs> Jesus flannel boards. Oh, and it, yeah. have you seen? anything with Jesus like he would be walking on water or you know healing people and it was cool I remember that from when I was a kid <laughs> that's awesome baby <laughs> you can do it that's how God was working in my life even when I was a even kid even when you See? didn't even know him through flannel through, through flannel. flannel people <laughs> flannel people flannel boards flannel board flannel people boards. okay so here are my tags not bad considering I am in a hurry go ahead and show them Kitty. I have a couple more that I can do. But, oh, you know what? Actually, I did die cut Ken. So hang on. Let me do one for Ken. Um, Just I die handwrite it on there like you say. Oh, trust me. <laughs> trust me. Don't, don't try to me. act. Show don't, off. Don't get me any ideas. Actually, I lost the E, so I might have to write the E on there. Um, yeah, so it's not even going to happen because I can't find the E. Yeah. See, seriously, you guys, now it's crunch time. Now, I hope you guys are all, like, busy doing stuff while you're watching just because, you know, we're running out of time around this joint, right? I think, like, in, <laughs> a new thing is maybe okay. in 2021, 2022, is every time you lose something, you have to have a drawing. Oh, that's a good idea. <laughs> I mean, we might go out of business oh. <laughs> but okay well let's do another drawing what should what should the question be i want it to be christmas related otherwise i'd get into the tin um something about christmas uh what's your favorite christmas song yeah what's your favorite christmas song yes okay about that? so list your favorite christmas song everybody is allowed to enter you could just say jingle bells for all i care but i want you to everyone enter for a chance to win a 25 dollars gift certificate to the website my favorite song, and I will be honest, it makes me cry almost every single time. Deborah says, Ken, you are a hoot. Um, Ellen says, I remember those from when I was little, too. See? See. Um, was, they can't see me do my Ken. Uh, was, is the song, Mary, Did You Know? Let me tell you, that song, Mary, Did You Know? I can't sing it. Your baby. As long as it's not Mr. Grinch, Sometimes. you're a mean one, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so there's my kid. Look at that. Look at that. I could have done a lot more, but we're in a hurry. Um, so that is my favorite song. I want to know what your favorite song is. Oh, Holy Night. Ooh. Mary, did you know somebody said that one? Oh, a lot of you are saying that one. Oh, I just love that one. Oh, it's just so... Oh, it's just so... Because can you imagine, those of you... Um, those moms out there. I just can't imagine poor Mary being, you know, in the middle of freakishly nowhere and being pregnant and being on a donkey and, and all of that that she went through. And, you know, oh, gosh, bless her heart. What an amazing story. Isn't it true? Um, okay, and I've lost like half my tags. But I'm not allowed to say that because then I have to do another. Oh, here they are. Um, but, yeah, so I always think about that, um, that, that. That song is just so amazing to me. So, okay, okay everybody's, uh, um, uh, Mary, did you know? Silent Night, Jingle Bells, Holy Night, Carol on the Bells. Oh, I don't know that one. The Little Drummer Boy. Oh, that one's sweet, too. That one's sweet, too. Oh, I love all of these. It's always fo so fun to go to church and, um, you know, on Christmas Eve, and we do, like, all of these songs, which is really fun. Um, look at me, I'm like totally putting stuff away. It's like, who am I? Who am I? What did I do with Stephanie, huh? Um, but, so, Kenny, are you going to pick a winner in a minute? Yeah, but I think everybody wants you to sing that full version of that song. Oh, shut first. up. I, cannot, <laughs> I can't even talk, let alone sing. Okay, he, he we'll let you off the hook this time. He, does, he, thinks, he thinks I'm a horrible singer, so he's making No, fun. no, no, no. We just wanted to hear you sing it because you love it so much. Mm-hmm. You'd you be a fine me. singer. Okay, so who won? He wants Our winner one. is from Facebook, Facebook, and she said White Christmas. It's Jane Johnson. Jane Johnson, you just won a $25 gift certificate to our website, my love. You are going to email Faylene at info at the stamps of life .com, and she is going to get that to you 
soon. We don't know. Must be nice to work at our company. Probably. <laughs> we don't even know when our employees work. Isn't that Pro awesome? Probably in 2021. Well, hopefully before <laughs> then. She's got to work a little bit next week. Don't worry. She's got, she's got to work a little bit next week. So next week, um, release date, the 31st that night, right? Um, we New Year's Eve. Woo. New Year's Eve. Are we going to party and do a live? What? <laughs> Have we ever done a live on New Year's Eve? No. Should we do a live on New Year's Eve? Ask everybody. Honey, you're usually asleep by... Well, we'd have to do it early. <laughs> what day oh, no, is I can't say it. Friday. Friday night? Yeah. Five o'clock? We'll think about it. Say. We might. We might. We have would to see if watch? anybody's... Yes. Would you guys watch if we did one? Because we know nobody's working. Be and it's Friday night. Will I have a no makeup Monday? Yes, I will. Yes, I will. I will. Um, yes, I will. And Kenny thinks he figured out a way for me to fix the internet. So, yes, I will. Um... Grinelda says, can I work for you part-time? <laughs> <laughs> um, let's see. Uh, do you hear what I hear? Oh, Billy, I love that one, too. I love that. Loretta says she would watch. One person? One so person far, she yeah. would watch. Oh, no, April said she would watch. Two. Oh, and that says, Ken, sing it to Stephanie. Oh, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, no. Uh, well, we, we would, it, would be, um, it would be like 5 p.m. Pacific time on new year's eve so that's 8 p.m eastern time so it'd be pretty fairly early um because hello my friends i am not going anywhere on christmas i mean new year's eve kenny and i always stay home um i'm always afraid of drunk drivers on new year's eve and kenny has to get up early 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 to ship your club shipments even though they don't really move on the first because it's a holiday but he likes to get it into the post office so the second they get there on the next day they start working on them I'm seeing a lot of yeses, Kenny. Well, here's one requirement. Everybody has to tell some, tell a friend to watch, too. <laughs> would that be a good deal? That would be a good deal. we're going to do it? That would be a good deal. If Okay, no, here's the deal. Here's the deal. If every... Okay, so all of you watching on Facebook and YouTube, if we get 100 people total to share this video, we will do a live on New Year's Eve. With more prizes. Is there a way to find out how many people yeah, shared it? Yeah, because when we go back and look, it'll say how many people shared it. Okay? You gave them the challenge. So I gave you a challenge. <sighs> you guys got to share it. If you want us to do something <laughs> live New Year's Eve with more prizes, we will need you to like, not only like, but share this video um, on YouTube and or Facebook or both because then your entry would get count as two. If we get 100 shares then we will do a live New Year's Eve, 5 p.m. Pacific, so those of you that are party animals can mm -hmm. still go do your parties. And we'll just let the, we'll just let the stream run till midnight, but there won't be anybody to party I'll with you, right? Happy New, Happy New Year! Happy New Year! And go back to bed. <laughs> or no, I'll take my phone and I'll, I'll show, here's Ken sleeping! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Happy New Year, Kenny! Yeah. And Kenny would go, yeah, I'll be snoring. Yeah. yeah, he'll be snoring. Sorry. So, 100. Oh, Christine said liked and shared on YouTube. How do you share? You guys tell everybody how to share it. You click on Facebook. I know you click the little arrow that says share, and then it'll share it to your um, Facebook account. So, um, Ruth said she shared. Loretta said she shared. Michelle said woohoo. Lisa said shared. Sylvie said shared. Loretta said shared. Let's see. Let's see. Liked and shared, Layla says. Um, Christine says, I don't um, drive on um, on that night either. Yeah, me either. Um, Cynthia says she'll watch while she's cooking her prime rib and lobster dinner. Oh. Cynthia, what time are you delivering our dinner for us? Maybe we could do the live from her house. Let's do the live from her house, Cynthia. Where do you live? Um, liked and shared, Chris said. Thank you. Marisa Dunn. Thank you. So if we get 100... Does it say yet, Kenny, how many have done it on Facebook right there at the top? Three. <laughs> Three. <laughs> we got a long ways to go. What? <laughs> what? Does it, sh is it? It might be delayed because, be you delayed. know, yeah. Okay. Like and share. Like and share. 100. Oh, Monica says on YouTube, click on share on your YouTube and it gives you options to choose where to share. Thank you. On YouTube, hide live chat, and there's a share button. Chris.
Christine said. Thank you. And even if you can't do it right now live, you can probably go back and find the video and share it, right? There's That's probably true. ways to do yeah, that. Yeah, I don't too, think right? you have to do it right this second. Once yeah. we end the video, I think you'll have a, still have a chance It'll to be, do it. It might be easier. So I think you'll still have a chance to do it after we finish it up. So, okay, we're going to be watching. Okay, so my friends, we need to head out. But I just want to say thank you. I hope you all have a wonderful, happy, 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 um, Merry Christmas. Um, I hope you're able to be with your families a little. If not, FaceTime, Zoom calls. Make sure you touch bases with everyone you know, especially if you know of anybody that might be alone this holiday. Uh, it's a lonely time for some people. So, But I just want to say thank you. Um, from the bottom of our hearts and our entire family, um, we all want to say thank you. Um, thank you for your love, your support, and your prayers. They mean the world to us. On Christmas Day, we're sending out a newsletter that just shows a picture. It's just a picture of Ken, Stephanie, and the two babies. So you'll get to see a new picture of the babies in your email on Christmas Day. But um, I just want to say thank you. Um, God bless all of you. Please stay safe. And I will see you Monday for No Makeup Monday. And then I, by then we'll know the results if we're going to be doing a live New Year's Eve. Okay? Thank you all so much. I'll see you Monday morning, 10 a.m. Pacific, or close to. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.